Well, this whole time I thought I was recording, but here we are. Look at I have eczema by way, like. It's been tough. It's getting a bit bitchy air. This is why it looks foul here and then and then. I've, I've been I've taking been so long so to do long this video, video because I just. Missed. But that doesn't matter, you know, you're watching the video. And that's all that matters. Actually, it doesn't. There's way more important things than people watching what I do. So, why do I do this? Anyway, look here. 2020 is over. A lot has happened actually. Stuff that you guys don't even know. From getting a new phone, got into a relationship, then realized that I didn't need to be in a relationship. Oh, okay. 18Ks on TikTok. Committed to YouTube. I became a vegetarian. I became a vegetarian. Then we had celebrities follow me. Then I was on TV. I was dancing with some famous people. Suck on that, geeks! I worked out every day, or at least every day. Actually, when Varsity started getting hectic, I really like dropped out of working out. on yourself to make any goals and all that blah, blah, but there obviously were things that I would would have loved but look here yeah, I think the best way to make this video you know enjoy enjoyable for you beautiful people because I tend to be very talkative and get very boring and this is probably why I should keep quiet my top five moments of 2020 short and quick you better watch kids okay so I made like a list what is number five Sometimes I thought to myself this whole year, I, I don't need this in my life, like there's no need for it. But at the end of the day, it's gonna get me a job. job. God willing, you know. I survived university. That's just amazing. It was ups and downs. It was lefts and rights. But I learned a lot, especially during a pandemic. Okay, that was number five. Wow, survived university. I'm about to graduate. I don't know because I still have an assignment that I need to submit. But technically, I'm done. So, kids, can we just pray that Chrissy Dams gets her bachelor's degree in April? Thank you, Lord, for bringing me this far. He done me good. He done me good. Anyway, next. That was number five. Surviving so university. university. At, At number, four number four comes come. a committed relationship to YouTube. The fact that I committed to YouTube. Whoa, whoa. Personally, I thought I'm gonna get over it. I'm gonna give up and say, like, nobody watches my stuff. Because I only get 50 views. But, you know, I was like, I don't care how many views I get because I am having fun. fun. So, I'm vlogging. This is a video I've been wanting to do. I'm back, I'm back. kids. Kid. Watch who like it. Chrissy Dancy's here, kids. I'm back. I'm vlogging again. <laughs> Hi, guys. But I'm gonna vlog today. I'm back. I hope this is in focus. Yo, so that was number four. Like, people actually were like, Chrissy Dance, we love what you're doing. And that just motivated me. Also, wait a minute, reaching 200 subscribers. I didn't think it would reach that. That was commitment to YouTube for our fourth top moment of 2020 for Chrissy Dance. Coming at number three, we have famous people following Chrissy Dance on Instagram. Guys, if you didn't know that this happened, me. But yeah, it happened and that's exciting. Atando Kani from Black Panther. Paxton Phillies from Idols season. I don't know. But yeah, she's famous. I remember Atando Kani was like, this girl's so cool, oh my gosh. And then he followed me. Yo! <laughs> I'm coming to love that video. <laughs> then I just saw Paxton Phillies following me and I was like, wait, when did that happen? You know? But guys, Atandua. Kani, John Kani's son, who played the father of Black Panther when the father was younger. You know what I'm talking about if you are a real Marvel fan. Thank you very much. That's me. You will return home at once, or you will face the council and inform them of your crimes. Okay, that was number three for Chrissy Dance's top five moments of 2020. I'm so tough going to the nominee right now. Actually, I think I'm gonna cut it. It's time to cut it. Oh, birthday's coming up, so. I'm getting very awkward right now because I don't know what to do and I'm like, gonna cut it. Confused about life. 
you can see that I'm very uncomfortable filming this. Maybe I shouldn't even post it. But, but, okay, coming at number two. Who Christy has the top five moves of 2020? Something she believes sparked her success? Is it success? Achievements? No. Okay, let's just get into it. Number two, like, it's gonna be like, is it shallow and stuff? It has to be the fact that I bought an iPhone. The reason I believe, for one, that it's in my top five moments and that it sparked, like, my buzz is because for one I was able to keep on creating content I made like so many videos and I was just like motivated, motivated. just keep creating and from there on I just got like I don't know things just started happening for me it was literally like from in March 2020 when I bought that iPhone till now I'm, I feel just like things have just been happening for me I think that was the first time I made a decision to just just go for it. At the end of the day, none of the positions you have right now doesn't matter. I just, I just know things started happening. I started creating a lot of videos. Those celebrities, they followed me on Instagram. I decided to do TikTok. And then I got 80k views on a video collabs for two of my friends for these songs. Because of the constant creation, which was as a result of having quality, my one friend that I always speak to, we like keep saying, if only we had this. Once I got this iPhone, it like pushed me. You have no reason not to create. Because at the end of the day, users on social media are drawn to crisp quality. Like that's like, let's address the elephant in the room. It is like that. I got, I got the means now. Post, make videos, boom. Boom, and that's that's just how it happened. That was number two, getting an iPhone. Yeah, it is kind of shallow. Let's go, go on, on to, number, to one. number one. I think everybody knows what number one is. If you don't know what it is, then I think it's either you very new to Chrissy Dance to the YouTube channel, or you just haven't been paying attention. Okay, my chatons. Coming at number, number one, number one, number one, one, one for Chrissy Dance's top five moments of 2020. Can we have a drum roll, please? Uh, <sighs> I actually mentioned it in the beginning. Okay, I don't know how to how to enjoy this. My, my first, first ever, ever professional, professional gig, gig and, and along, along with that with TV that appearance. appearance. <laughs> Watch, it's not gonna be me. They call out my name, and the next day, rehearsal, rehearsal, rehearsal. A week later, more rehearsals. Another week later, rehearsals, rehearsals. Show day, dancing with Moon Child. Young Chief. Being in the presence of Mafiki Zolo. That was my para jazz. Who else was there? Nongrebo. Like, I think Amifako was there, but we didn't dance for her. I was, I was, I was amongst, amongst and amidst, amidst the people, people that was famous, famous here in the South Africa. Africa. Oh my god, oh. I'm in love with my life. Wow. wow. Speaking of which, I'm gonna have a video of all BTS. But something's coming. Anyway, yeah, that's my top five moments. I hope this was not too long. Probably was. I'm just gonna cut it now. Thank you for 200 subscribers. Everybody that's always made an effort to tell me they like all the YouTube video that I do. It's gonna be a new year. I don't have any university distractions. Sorry, mommy. Sorry, Can we manifest getting a job for 2021? Like, subscribe. Put on your post notifications because I think that actually might help with my analytics. Follow me wherever you can. And I say keep dancing. Um, yeah, thank you so much.